beautiful friends and tribe. I hope you're having a beautiful day today. In today's video, once again I go into a trance meditation to communicate with my amazing team of spirit guides. Today, spirit ventures us into late 2024, moving into 2025, telling us that the darkness on the planet has had a hold on humanity for many generations, and that's all about to end as we go into these new cycles over the next few years. The outcome of the medical structure, the current medical system, and the future ways of healing, along with techniques and things and advice to help us through these times of intense ascension that we're in now, but definitely heading more into in 2025. The coming darkness in a period of darkness, followed by the light and light ascension codes that will shift everything, including the younger generation and what they're going to bring to the table. The future of the Earth's energy and how we're running vehicles and things in the future, along with what could be coming in December and again in the year 2025. We all expect perhaps some type of a shift in the Earth, but how about also a shift in our solar system? This is just a little of what you're going to hear in today's video. Something both amazing and extremely challenging is ahead for humanity as humanity heads into the ending of a very, very long cycle on the planet Earth. Humanity will witness 9.0 and even 9.5 earthquakes throughout the globe over the next three to four years. Not all as a big shift in the plates beneath the Pacific that runs into the Asian continent begins to flip over itself, causing a great crater to go across the Asian continent, mainly in China. China will experience the largest earthquake the way it's meant, using the earth and the earth's vibrations to create energy to use this natural energy to power up the future earth. Nothing, as you see now, will be as it is once you get beyond 2032. The technologies and the sound frequencies that do shrink and eliminate cancer cells, cancer tumors, and they suppress the hospitals will become hubs all over the planet. Natural healing centers one major one that branches out in all directions. Every continent will have these special healing centers. And those that you thought were taken out or who had passed away are still alive. And there are three very significant. One has been in hiding with the government and the FBI working hard on breaking a huge case. tribe beautiful friends once again i hope you're having an amazing day i welcome you back to my channel if you're new here i welcome you to my channel my name is joseph tittle aka spirit man jt and i'm so happy that you're here with me today also if you're new here down below you'll find all the links to all my social media platforms including the awaken your spirit subscribe star platform of supporters without my supporters this free content wouldn't be possible for everybody else so I thank you with infinite love and gratitude. You'll also find down below the link to my newsletter. It's free. In the beginning of each month, you'll find out what's going on in the realms of numerology, astrology, and all the content that I put out, upcoming classes, and so much more. You can also find all that out on my website, josephtittle.com or spearmanjt.com. And if you get a message on social media from anybody that appears to be me, I assure you, it is not me. Report those profiles immediately. You will never receive contact and direct messages from me on any social media platform other than directly from my email and directly from my website, josephtittle.com or spearmanjt.com. So shall we move on with today's piece, which I did today when I'm recording this. It is uh, Monday, August 26th, and I did this a couple days ago. And I actually did two different channeled meditations. I did one on, I think, Friday or Saturday night. And then I did another one on Sunday, yesterday. Two separate ones. I was going to put them together in one video. 
but I'd rather separate them because they are completely different meditations. So I will have that out soon. And if you're new here, be sure to smash that subscribe button, hit the bell, and all so you never miss any content. And always come back and check if you don't see me in your notifications. Come back and check because sometimes people mysteriously become unsubscribed. Let us move on with today's meditation. Something both amazing and extremely challenging is ahead for humanity as humanity heads into the ending of a very, very long cycle on the planet Earth, starting over and having an opportunity for renewal on the entire planet as humanity slowly steps into the new Earth in the higher dimensional fields. But it is of the utmost importance that you stay connected to the earth and take time for yourself and to meditate and be prepared for all circumstances. Meditation will help you to ascend to the higher levels to make these challenging times much easier to flow through over the next two to three years especially what's ahead for humanity as 2024 comes to a close and we step into 2025, a year that will be one of the most challenging years to date for humanity. Things, as you know, it will come to an end. Things will come to a close. Many countries will change. Lands will change. Lands will become redivided to new lands and new territories, all in the long run serving to the highest good of humanity. But at first, it will not appear to be the case, as the light fights ever so strongly against the darkness that has taken a hold over humanity for so many generations. The time for this darkness to have this hold on humanity is coming to an end. It does not want to give up without a fight. It does not want to let go of the power in which it holds all over the planet. Not only that for humans, but that for the galactic people that do not have the highest good for humanity, that live right within humanity. You know them, but you do not recognize them. This truth will be revealed, as it has, but many yell, conspiracy, conspiracy. But there is so much truth Beyond that in which is labeled conspiracy. So much truth that will be unveiled. But it must come slowly. For too much at once will be too much for humans to handle. And even the creatures of the earth are shifting and evolving to the new earth. In this process, it must be slow. As much as many wish it to come overnight, it's not going to be the case. You are already transcending into this new earth. You are already on the doorsteps to this new earth. Again, it's just the challenges and struggles you must endure while going through this cycle. It will be much easier for you to do so, to be prepared both physically, but most importantly, spiritually. Whether that be through prayer, through your own personal ceremonies and honoring of the divine in which you wish to honor, but also to stay grounded and meditation will be the key for helping you to ascend with ease and joy. Meditation, again, is the key. You must take time for you. Time to just sit in your own space alone with your own thoughts and your own energies. Soon, in a short time, humanity is going to be forced to sit in that darkness, forced to contemplate on life, and more importantly, the future and where we want our future to go. In turn, new knowledge and new wisdom would be downloaded to humanity, along with a new set of eyeglasses to help humanity see beyond the 2020 vision and to help humans see into the other dimensions. Being able to identify the intruders that have intruded on humanity many generations ago. Again, they live upon you. You know them, but you do not know beyond what you see. Remember, not everything is as it appears to be. Remember, this is important. As 2024 comes to a close, another cycle will be upon you in the month of December. 
a cycle in which it is important that you pay very close attention and be mindful of your health and of your well-being and that of your spirituality. To be safe and know that this transition and cycle too will pass in time. As you step in to 2025, it'll appear as if 2024 goes out with a bang, but 2025 also comes in with a bang. As January and the cold winter months break records for snowfall, ice storms all over the globe, new conflicts will break out. New secret attacks upon the people, especially those within the Middle East. Great conflict is to come. Pray and hold in the light goodness over not just the Middle East, but over the entire planet. For the web of darkness that all of humanity has been caught up in for so long is being dismantled. And in turn, it is up to you to spin your web of light and to put out into the world that in which you wish to see for yourself, for your children, for your grandchildren, and for future generations. This is now in your hands. The time has come where many will stick it out, but many others will decide not to stick it out any longer, as many decide to exit all within a short amount of time. You are not to fear this cycle. Again, this is a part of your soul contracts and agreements. Those, again, who stay grounded, meditate, and stay connected to your spirituality and to the earth will help you to get through these times much easier. As you step into 2025, you will immediately begin to see the major Earth shift changes occurring all over the planet Earth. This is also happening on other planets within the solar system. And you will soon be able to witness major events happening on other planets, including on your moon itself, that will have so many asking questions. If the climate is changing on the Earth, then what's happening on Mars or our moon? It appears that everything is changing. Everything is shifting, not just the Earth, but the entire solar system. This is how we move from the three to the four to the five-dimensional Earth, a time where all humanity celebrates in pure love the goldenness of life and everyday being on the Earth. When humanity comes together in communities, and rebuilds in a natural way, the way it's meant. Using the earth and the earth's vibrations to create energy, to use this natural energy to power up the future earth. Nothing, as you see now, will be as it is once you get beyond 2032. As 2025 begins and kicks off, you will see the most major Winter storms that you have endured in many places, breaking world records for the amount of snowfall and for the amount of ice that piles up in many places, causing roofs and buildings to collapse from the heaviness of the ice topped off with the snow. It'll seem like nobody is safe from the wild weather that comes in in 2025. Pay attention to January, for this will show you what you are in for in 2025. As new land masses begin to split, new land masses come from the ocean rising up. You will see so much shift and changing of the poles and of your land masses and continents in 2025, shifting everything. Coastlines will be completely flooded out from massive storms, unlike storms you have yet to see. Typhoons that cross the Pacific, wiping through Asia, causing dams to break and bridges to be washed out. Be aware when you are told these storms are heading your way and get to high ground. High ground. Because along with these big heavy rain storms that come in 2025, they will also be accompanied by huge waves and seas that are rougher than normal. In 2025, you will witness the oceans swallowing up and claiming more 
landmass, and more humans than ever recorded in your timeline. This is a part of the recycling of Mother Earth that does occur every 12,000 years. This recycling and this shift of the planet is Mother Earth's way of cleaning up the toxicity that humans have left behind and the messes that humans have left behind. That will in turn cause you to shift into the higher dimensional fields where things will be much more clean and fresh and free of the disaster zones that come with the earth changes. You will see some of it, but you will not live all of it. So again, have no fear, be prepared, and I cannot stress to you how important it is to meditate and get out into the forest and connect with nature. In 2025, you will see great shakings and disasters on every continent, including on Antarctica, a continent where you will witness more ice melt and floods returning from this ice melt than ever previously recorded. The sun will heat things up to a high temperature while your global elite continue to manipulate weather patterns, making things way worse than Mother Earth intends them to be. Although, in the long run, they will fail, and these truths will be revealed. As you have noticed, in 2024, many truths are being revealed, revolved around the manipulation of humanity, the manipulation of your weather, and the manipulation of your future. This even includes the manipulation of your economy. Therefore, all must fall for new to be built upon that land. So know that you will be the phoenixes that rise from the ashes of the destruction that was brought upon by humans in the global elite themselves, not realizing that that destruction will destroy them, those in charge, as they say. It is time to see that power dwindle down to nothing, and it will. Great shifts and changes through the Pacific especially between China and Alaska, affecting China, Alaska, Japan, and all those close within the Pacific. As a big shift in the plates beneath the Pacific that runs into the Asian continent begins to flip over itself, causing a great crater to go across the Asian continent, mainly in China. China will experience the largest earthquake of all the major earthquakes that are coming. Humanity will witness 9.0 and even 9.5 earthquakes throughout the globe over the next three to four years. Not all just happening in 2025, but 2025 being a time where so many endings and so much is going to change. There is a plan by the global elite to collapse your economy and instill their mark of the beast. This is something they have planned for many decades. They wish to initiate and ignite this plan, and they plan to do so in the late part of 2024, finalizing that plan with other backup plans, including that of an attempt to find reasons to keep you in your home once again and find fear-related tactics, that being related to weather changes and weather shifts, including that of new bugs that are released purposely, but not successfully. Do not fear that in which they tell you. Again, remember, nothing as it appears to be, especially when it comes from your media. Nothing is as it appears to be. Watch for the liars, the deceivers. For their lies and their deceit are slowly seeping out. The lies and the deceit of these global elite are inevitably going to be seen by all of humanity, even those who are asleep. As new lights and light codes come down over the next year that take humanity and the consciousness of humans to a whole nother level, naturally, without the 
interference of technologies like that in which your global elite wish to do and already have done. Know that when a plant becomes frail and fragile and falls to the earth, it reseeds itself and grows again. And that is what you are going to see as you see things wither away in the destruction of so much as the year 2024 comes to a close and 2025 comes in. By spring and late March and early April of 2025, you will see a new birth coming to the planet, a new light as April enters in in 2025 you will get to witness amazing things and amazing innovations coming into fruition and into the light. Patents in which have been suppressed by governments, mainly the United States government, will be released. And these technologies will come into the light once again. So many at one time that they'll no longer be able to suppress these technologies. The young ones the little ones that are now in their late teens and in their 20s will soon all receive a light code message that will give them the innovations and the technologies in their brain to launch these technologies. And again, the divine has created this to happen all in one time so that the darkness will be overwhelmed with the light and will not be able to stop these technologies from getting in the hands of helping humans and not just humans, but creatures, the plants, the trees, and so many technologies, including the technologies that will heal you and cure you of all diseases, starting with the cures that already do exist for cancer, breast cancer, all types of cancer. We already know. The governments already know. The technologies and the sound frequencies that do shrink and eliminate cancer cells, cancer tumors, and they suppress this. But again, too many people are discovering these technologies again at one time. Therefore, they cannot stop it from happening. And soon your hospitals will collapse your hospitals will go bankrupt and people will seek out the new natural healing and the new technological advances of healing. Amazing technological advances. And as dangerous as AI artificial intelligence is, artificial intelligence will assist humans in amazing new journeys of healing, both physically, energetically, and emotionally. In the future Earth, your hospitals will become hubs all over the planet, natural healing centers, one major one that branches out in all directions. Every continent will have these special healing centers that help people through all sorts of healing processes, whether it be that of addiction, substance abuse, mental illness, cancers, diseases, all of these things will be directly focused on and targeted in the new world of healing in a way that people lead happy, healthy, joyful lives without side effects of medications and pharmaceutical drugs that bring them down instead of lifting them up. Pharmaceutical drugs to some level will exist in the future and on the future earth for many do help and are amazing. But as time progresses over the next few decades, many diseases will be cured by healthy eating, sound frequencies, and other methods of healing that soon there won't be worries for diseases like diabetes, arthritis, Alzheimer's, dementia, and the list goes on and on. Something for humanity to get excited and to be joyful of, for this will be here for many that are here on the earth now, and for all of your ancestors in the future. A future where all of humanity lives in a joyful, healthy atmosphere. In 2025, you will expect to see not only many more leaders leaving power, but you will see shifts and changes in power in many countries after it is demanded by humans. The more humanity awakens and receives their stronger 
2020 beyond eyeglasses, and they see directly through the corruption as they are beginning to see already, folks will have too much. They already had enough. And in 2025, it is the year of endings, a year in which you will see power struggles unlike anything you've seen before, fights for power, people being taken out of power. You will see two deceased heads of power in 2025 that will be poisoned. One of these will be out of Russia. Beware, Putin. They are out to poison you in 2025. They already tried and failed. But the next time, they may not fail so much. Beware. You'll see other attempts. And again, a major fight and struggle over power in 2025. This includes power and CEOs of corporations. In turn, you will also see the corruption and the arrests that shock people all over the world. As you see people rounded up in different places being arrested for the corruption and the truth that comes out. Not only will you see truth come out, you will also see some in which you thought were once deceased rise from the dead and be alive once again. Those that you thought were taken out or who had passed away are still alive. And there are three very significant. One has been in hiding with the government and the FBI working hard on breaking a huge case, a global case of corruption. This will be shocking when it does eventually come to the surface. So will the fact that this man still lives, but he lives to tell the truth. There will be three that will appear. And you may likely see one of these dead rise again and be alive before 2024 comes to a close. Some of the arrests that you see taking place in late 2024 and throughout 2025, be aware for some will be set up. Most will be finally the truth of their corruption and facing the consequences for it. But there will be a few, again, in the fight for power and to take power, will be wrongly accused, completely wrongly accused and put behind bars in order for other power to stay in power or to take power. Be aware. And when this occurs, humans and people of that country must step forward and they must demand the truth and demand what they have voted for to stay in place. The corruption is a lie. But the corruption is not a lie. And that's the fine details that will be revealed in 2025. The corruption that is true and the corruption that is false. Beautiful tribe, there you have it. I very much hope you enjoyed that meditation and the information from my team of spirit guides. I greatly appreciate all of you and I greatly appreciate my team of spirit guides. For without them, we wouldn't have this amazing information and without you, I wouldn't have anybody to share it with. And please do share this on your social media, share it with others, and be sure if you're new here and you want to vibe with the tribe, do not forget to smash the subscribe, the bell, and all. And remember, you can catch me every Tuesday for Tuesday's Tittle Tea Time Predictions Update, where we look at world events and stories and how they may or may not relate to predictions and prophecy, with new predictions each and every week. So if you don't see me pop up in your notifications on Tuesday or by Wednesday, then go directly to my channel to make sure you're still subscribed. Thank you also for showing your love. Takes a lot of time, a lot of energy to put this content together for all of you. And I greatly appreciate that thumbs up. That helps the algorithms get this to more people to help our tribe to grow, friends, to help it grow. Other than that, again, remember all the links down there in the description. Until the next time, my beautiful friends and beautiful tribe, remember to celebrate life and celebrate you. Be kind to others as you wish others be kind to you. And remember to be bold, be true, be kind, be you. Let your light shine and have a beautiful rest of your day. Namaste and much love, much love.